Ah, uh, yeah. If you have been using CapCut more recently, you will have noticed something a little bit frustrating, which is most of the useful feature that you love using to edit your videos, you know, those quick tools that you just drag, drop onto your video that will give you that classy edit have already been moved behind a paywall in the pro version. And the pro subscription is a little bit expensive. But don't worry because I've got some tricks up my sleeves that will help you get around that, have access to these premium features without actually having to pay for the pro version. Trust me, the last trick will completely blow away your mind. So like we all know, CapCut is one of the best video editing software we have there, especially when you want to do that quick edit on the go. Just some light things you have to add to that video right before you post them. But recently, they have made some of their most useful features like animation and effects, rich text decoration, cinematic filters, retouch, only available to the pro users which can get pretty annoying if you are just trying to edit your video without actually having to spend money so here is the first trick i use when i want to have access to pro features without actually having to pay for them so first we have to head on to CapCut, which is our video editing software that we have been using so then we click on new projects basically just to start a new project over and then we select the video we want to edit so one thing I always advise is you see you have to come down here and click on this HD button just so as to maintain the quality of our video while we are editing it and also when we are done when we want to export it because if we don't click on this HD button if your video was shot in high resolution it will drop it down so when you are trying to edit it will kind of reduce the video quality that is why you see you get blurred video you'll be like oh when I shot this video it was clear but now that I'm done editing it it's kind of blurry probably because we did not turn on this feature so we we'll go ahead and turn on the hd then bring it down to our timeline so as you can see this is the video we'll be making use of for this demonstration so first thing we have to do we have to click on the video and go ahead and use one of the pro features that we see so just scroll down okay we can see that auto frame here has a label that we can see it says it's a pro it's a pro feature so we click on it and then let's go for is it 9 by 16 which is basically more what most um, social media use as you can see it's tiktok here so our tiktok instagram and other um platforms basically it's for reels it's for reels so this is um youtube form and others so let's go to so let's go for this yeah so it's applying as you can see it's a pre feature so it will take some time to apply it so it has already applied auto reframe applied to our clip so you go ahead and click on this you can use the pro features as much as you want we just have to go ahead okay this is relight also a pro feature so you can see here it will always tell you that this is a pro feature it distinguish between free and pro so basically you know if you are using CapCut, you definitely know this relight it's just how you kind of bend the lights to your taste you know add more um, brightness to this place not actually brightness like the lighting add a lighting you select the color you want and everything so um this is relight as you can see we can increase the intensity um the radius and the distance let's see okay um we are choosing a point light now let's choose a directional light so it's applying let's wait a few seconds because these are pro features so they'll usually take a little time before they um been they are being applied to your clip so that's just it that's why they are being made pro because it's actually um require more computation so as you can see this is i think kind of okay but let's see we can always do something more to the video uh okay let's see if you can kind of select another relighting format i'm not really okay with that so let's go back to relight uh let's see this okay okay yeah so i'm kind of full with this so i'll go ahead and click on this so as you can see everything i'm using it's under pro it's under pro it's pro features that i'm using and at the end of the day i will do everything and you see that you have your content out clean with the pro features so um let's just don't take waste much of the time as you can see we already have about two pro features here that we have already um added to our clip so when you are done adding everything you want to your video be it the text the overlay the transitions the frame adjust everything just 
edit to your best preference and don't worry if you are using the pro feature because i'm here to guide you on how you can actually work around that so the next thing you do is actually drag this notification toggle here and go to this place that says screen record so you just have to take a screen record of the video so when you have click on the screen record you just have to come back here and then click on this full screen so it will take the screen record of the complete screen and again okay for my samsung users this is a quick tip if you're a samsung user before you click on the screen record just come down here and click on the screen record and you will see that you have different video quality so what i will always advise to do to get the best out of your video not to make it a bit blurry and what's not like i mentioned earlier you just have to skip this one which says low 480p so this is not actually good and we have medium 720p you just have to skip down to and then come to high which says 1080p so that is what you should record on so this is like a major plus if you're a samsung user i will drop a link to the video i made consisting 30 samsung tips and tricks that will boost the way you use your samsung device so probably a lot of people don't know about this so this is another trick i'm showing i'll make sure to link the video down in the description below so make sure you check it out so that you will know every nook and cranny and explore whole lot of new features in your samsung device so when you are done screen recording you just have to wait for it to take the complete screen record of the full screen so you see as you can see my pro feature which is the relight is still there it did not go it's still there so when the um when the video is done recording all you have to do is just go back click on new project again and import the video you screen record so this is our video then we click on hd always don't forget so we click on import so you just have to trim your video go to where you made the screen record let's find it <laughs> okay so here it is so we just have to click on this and split we don't need the previous part this we just delete it so you just go here and click on delete so we don't need that part so this is where we need exactly for our video so actually because i'm using a mouse for demonstration that's why you could see this mouse here but in your case you are not making use of a mouse for demonstration so it should be clean so what you have to do next is just come down here and go to where it says transform click on it then click on resize so what this we just do is just that you have to crop in your video because we import our video in hd and we also screen record in 1080p even after screen recording we will not lose that much of quality you know our video will still have retained its quality and it will have every detail it has like the initial video we imported so all you just do is just go here and then crop the video a bit then go back up here and crop the video also bring it down so you just have to press on um okay yeah so as you can see we have our video which is looking very clean using pro features without actually having to pay for any pro feature so we can see so for your own you just have to add anything you like be it text my own i just use relight and the auto framing you can use any pro feature you see in carport it is absolutely free to do it this way so for the first trick we are almost done the last thing you should do is just come down here and click on 2k slash 4k depending on the um your memory size as it says it says restores your video to ultra high definition boss uses more memory so if you have enough space on your video on your phone you should definitely turn this on so it should export it at its highest quality so you just have to click on export and in few seconds you should have your videos ready to go using pro feature without paying a dime for it so that's the first trick all right if you still want to go further and unlock all carport pro features permanently without having to do the long walk around of screen recording and whatnot here is something that I personally use and it works perfectly fine for me. This actually involves downloading a modified version of CapCut which unlocks the pro features which you actually use completely fine on your device that works exactly like the CapCut but it has been modified to unlock all the whole of the pro features. So let's go around and check it out. So we open the modified version of the CapCut. As you can see it looks exactly like the CapCut application. So we click on new project then we allow. Then we wait a while then we click on this video to edit so as we can see the interface look exactly like the CapCut application that we know but the difference here is everything here is actually free so every tool you use regardless of it being a pro or whatever there is no even the pro inscription here so everything you use here is actually free ranging from animation 
all the animation you use here are actually free to use you don't have to pay a dime to use them you just have to go around and check out the features that you want to use just click on them and use them you don't actually have to pay a dime so for your own safety and to ease the stress of having to go around the internet looking for the modified version of CapCut, i've got a simple solution to that which is simply join my telegram group which i will link down in the description below which i've already uploaded the modified version of the CapCut. all you have to do is just click on the download and after it's downloading just install it to your device and you will use everything you see there for free so click on the link below and join my telegram group not to miss out on this easy 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 trick this is by far the easiest and safest method you will get out here so if you did find this video very very helpful smash on the subscribe button and turn on the notification so that you don't miss out when i make my tech uploads and if you have any question or any difficulty going around this just make a comment down in the comment section below and i'll be ever willing to come to your rescue as soon as possible like always my friends catch you the next one peace out